What's up guys, welcome back to my second Discord Pi tutorial. Today we're going to make a simple but highly functional bot that deletes messages in a specific channel. If you are looking for a beginner's Discord bot tutorial, go check out my first video. And if you find this video helpful, leave a like and consider subscribing. In one of the servers I'm a part of, we have a text channel just for images. This channel is regulated by a bot, so if you try to type a text message, the bot will delete it from the channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a bot just like this. The first thing you need to do before you've even coded your bot is to go to your server, click here and go to server settings, and then you want to go to roles, and then scroll down to manage messages, and make sure this is clicked on. This will allow your bot to delete or manage messages. Now I just have my Python file open with our basic template where we import the Discord library. We set client equal to discord.client and we run our client with our private token. So now we're gonna start with the deleting messages. So we can do at client event and then we'll do async def on underscore message and we'll pass in our message as an argument. All right, so this event will be triggered when someone sends a message. Now first we'll check if that message, so message.channel is equal to the certain channel you don't want a message to be sent in. So I'm just gonna say general because my test server only has a general text channel right now. And we're going to say if our message dot content does not equal an empty string, then we're going to proceed to delete it. So what this basically checks, it checks if it's not an image. So if it's not an image, it will go ahead and delete the message. To delete the message, we use something called await message dot channel dot purge so this is going to delete the message from the message that channel or the message the channel was sent in and then we're just going to set that inside limit equal to one all right and last thing is to make sure that message dot channel is a string so we have all our data types matching up now let's actually run this code and wait a little bit and then we can go back to our discord server and we see that our tutorial bot is online so let's try typing some random text and there we go it deletes if I type text it deletes the text and we're all good now if I upload an image then our image stays and our text still deletes. I hope you found this video helpful. I know the documentation for the Discord Pi library is a little iffy. It's hard to understand, so this is why I'm making these videos. And if you would like more Discord Pi tutorials, please leave a comment down below to let me know. Thanks for watching.